Yo, what is good guys? Check out all of these sneaker reblogging IG posts from Jordan Depot, blah blah blah, and all of them. It's pretty dope. But here's what happened. But I did not show well I did show it on my IG post, but here it is in the flesh. So that's the one I did. Alright. Here's the one I have yet to do because of this custom fail right here. Uh, damage on the pan leather because I use a Dremel and I guess I was a little bit too abrasive on the on, on the upper go so what I did here I poured acetone to preserve the or to rip away the the foam easily but the downside is that the pan leather wrinkled up a little bit actually I don't know what do you guys think is that a lot or a little bit natural and a little crinkled up so this is the result okay and this is how it should be okay aside from that scratch right so if i want to hide this i have to go a lower very very low right you look like this that doesn't look good guys that does not look good Might as well just do this, bro. I don't know, man. I'm torn, guys. I'm freaking torn. I'm, uh, I didn't, I didn't, like, see anyone else do it. Had to learn from my own mistakes. And I'm, instead of having you guys make the same mistake, I'm letting you guys know now. Do not use a Dremel unless you're very comfortable using your hand. And having a lot of control of the Dremel tool. So that's the only way if you want to preserve the pan leather. You have to use a Dremel tool. But just be aware that that might happen. All right, so it's my little custom fail. I'm gonna finish it. I'm gonna figure out a way to make it look factory because everything else looks perfect. The toe looks perfect. The medial side looks perfect. The back looks kind of perfect. We just have to line it up perfectly like that. It'll be good to go and yeah, man. <clears throat> but yo, man, <laughs> man. I just don't want that to be there. For me, I want it to look like exactly like a Jordan 11, but if it's too low, that's no bueno. You know what I mean? It's me, J JM, signing out.